Hi guys, I'm Andrew, a marketing and outreach intern at Learning Undefeated, a nonprofit that provides life-changing STEM opportunities, and today we're going to make Instant Ice. In this lab, we're going to learn about molecules and how they have to form a structure in order to create a solid. What we're going to do first is we're going to take our water bottles and we're going to put them next to the pizza rolls in the freezer. Now, I know what you're thinking. How long do we keep the water bottles in the freezer? Well, we recommend about 90 minutes, and every 15 minutes after, check to see if they're frozen. Later. Okay guys, so I got an update. Look what happened to one of my water bottles. It turned to slush. I'm gonna show you how I did it. I'm gonna take this water bottle out carefully, and oh! Goes right to the bottom. I'm gonna do it one more time, hopefully. Slowly, carefully. What we're gonna do is watch it go down. Awesome, right? I know what you're gonna ask. How does this all work? Well, the water actually wasn't frozen when it came out of the freezer. The water was actually what we call super cold. Basically, about to be frozen, but when there is some sort of an impact or an impurity in this already purified bottle of water, ice crystals are then allowed to build on it. So when I moved the water, there ended up being an impurity. The ice crystals found a way to build themselves, and that's why it went down the bottle. Pretty cool science, right? Now, obviously there's other ways you can do this experiment. For further investigation, you can pour the water, or you can also shake the bottle to see how the structure forms. Awesome job! You learn the difference between super cool and frozen water, and you also learn how ice crystals form. Yeah, take that, frozen! Learning Undefeated has plenty of more cool at-home STEM activities, so you can find us at learningundefeated.org slash at-home science. Thank you!